Hello, this is George Senda, the real, official, authentic, original, the one, the only. The official, the guy from Pittsburgh. And I got a call. <clears throat> Excuse me. I keep having to clear my throat. Someone would be nice could send me a bag of Hall's ment honey menthol eucalyptus cough throat. Cough drops would be appreciated. Got a call about 4.30 in the morning. I was up because I had to go to the bathroom as usual. From Kathy, normally we do not call each other up in the middle of the night. But she went and said that she's coughing. She's got nausea. She's got chills. She's got a headache that won't go away. I said, yep, you've got COVID. You better go to the hospital. So I called Patty. <clears throat> woke her up because it's an emergency and um, I said you might want to go get her or I told Kathy take an ambulance get to the hospital get taken care of don't want to lose you the, you, the cats need you so Patty told her to take call an ambulance and also to take her cell phone with her Kathy has a bad, she told me for weeks it didn't work, it wasn't charging anymore, I guess Patty fixed it. And I have not, for the record, seen Kathy since November 1st, and I came down with COVID on the 5th. And I, my theory is that because she's had to go to San Francisco multiple times and still had another tooth pulled, all the people running around on BART and Muni not wearing masks, that's how she got it. So, I want to let people know that's what's going on. I hope she'll be well. I hope they'll give her the antibodies and she'll recover. I'm coughing, and, but, but nothing comes up. And uh, occasionally, I think it's all the um, <clears throat> rain stirring up the pollen. I have to blow my nose a lot when I wake up in the morning. But other than that, I'm fine. I don't know if I'm chill I got chills because it's cold because uh, I'm always cold in here in the winter time. It is 65 degrees in here, but even with this long underwear on, I feel ice cold. So uh, unless I have a lot of blankets on top of me, <clears throat> I don't want to lose my sweetie though. We've been together a long time, so that's what's going on, and. Uh, so for, I, I told her last night in a call about her storage, you have bad habit of when I tell you to do something, you don't do it. You don't listen to me. You don't follow through. They're, they're threatening to get rid of her storage. So she's got to deal with that too. Okay, I don't expect any of me on live at 5.57 in the morning. But I want to let you know, we've been together for 45 years and I would not. And then the question is, if, God forbid she should die from this. I don't think she will if they give her the antibiotics. They killed it in me. I'm negative. Um, I have nowhere to put the cats. And they wouldn't do well. They, they would, they'd they have to go to someone very, very understanding. Because they hid under the bed for the first eight months. Because they were freaked out. Because they were being abused. Not by Kathy or me. But by their former owners, children, and dogs. And they love Kathy very much. So that's what's going on. All right, I'm going to go out and get the cat dishes. Uh, the the rug the cats love to sleep on. Last night I went out there and it was soaked. There was a lull in the rain. So I fed tiny one. Mama cat, kitten, gray, and pretty gray. The very large gray cat. Who is very gentle and sweet. He lets me pet him. And he has come up to my door in the past and had food up here. So he, I don't know if he's somebody's kitty, but he's an awfully big kitty and he doesn't look like he's starving, but he was sure hungry. I'll be right back. Oh, during the night, little girl with a bad kitty, she jumped up on the boxes here, knocked down my camera, I was sound asleep. She wants to go out so badly, but it's been pouring rain on mostly non stop all weekend. All right, kitties, I'll be out here in a minute. I know you're hungry. Move the hat here. Come on, Fluffy. Go ahead. Go ahead. Come on. Come on. You can go out. 
Come on now. Stop raining. You can go out. It is windy and ice cold out there. Hold on a minute. You go out too, little girl. Hold on. Go out too, sweetie. Right. Uh, go out, Kevin. You can go out. I was wrong, it's drizzling out there. <clears throat> but at least it's not pouring. And the cat, the mama cat and kitten are all wet. Oh, yeah. <sighs> they won't, I don't know why they're not sleeping in the kitty house. Where they can stay dry and warm. <sighs> Maybe I put too much bedding in there. anything in here this week that doesn't throw out garbage because it's been too damn cold. The wind has been ice cold. And most of the night howling. Water for the cats. <clears throat> I get food today. My kitties just said in. <laughs> okay. Anyway, sorry about that. Have to leave dry food and water out for the cats. All right. Uh, no one is in chat, so I'm going to go. I will keep you advised. It will take probably an hour for her to get to the hospital. <clears throat> Patty <clears throat> told her to get. Uh, <clears throat> Damn. Um, maybe I caught COVID by phone. Um, <laughs> told her to keep her cell phone with her. Maybe Kathy will do it for once. I'll let you know as soon as I hear anything. 
Both Patty and I will be waiting. All right, this is George Send to the guy from Pittsburgh with the special news update for Kathy. Pray for Kathy, please, and pray for me too and the cats. Have a great day and stay safe and stay warm. Snow all over California and back east. So major winter storms happening. Bye-bye for now.